start moving. Oh my, let's build something. Take it apart. I'm gonna throw up. Look at this cap at the bottom. <laughs> it was a little bit cursed. Welcome to the vlog. Today, my family and I are moving stuff into the house. This little me back there. We're officially moving in two days. So today's Thursday, we're moving on Saturday. But yeah, so today we're just moving the annoying stuff and then we will start moving, moving in two days. But I have so much more to do. I'm still not completely packed. And then we have to like deep clean the other house, which is gonna take a while. We're gonna do that on Sunday, the day after we like officially move in, and we're going to Best Buy right now. So we got the credit card. <laughs> <laughs> we're not going to Best Buy. We're going to the mall. I'm really bad at vlogging today. So we went to Best Buy. We got a TV mount, and we went to Starbucks. Well, pick me up. We deserve a treat. It's been a few hours, but now we're gonna go back to the old house, pick up some of the stuff that we're bringing over and then bring it over here. So it's gonna be a long night. Okay, so I realized, Merry Christmas. I realized I have not vlogged like all day, actually since yesterday. This is the current situation. I am packing up all of this stuff in the garage. Don't mind our garage, it's a mess right now. It doesn't usually look like this. There is so much to get done. We move in the morning. It is currently 7 p.m. But you know what? Let's do a little time lapse because I have nothing else to do right now. Tell me when the last time we used this juicer. Here's the other thing. That <laughs> oh my God. Oh my. Okay, you know what? I'm done. There are tiny dead cockroaches in this. This went very bad very quickly. I don't know if they're alive. Cockroaches live like forever. I am terrified. Oh my God, I can't stop looking at it. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Okay, I'm gonna go inside. I didn't know they could climb walls. That was on the wall. Oh, I have to jump over it. Okay. I'm gonna throw up. What if it starts moving when I go that way? Oh my God, I can't stop looking at it. Okay, ready? Okay. Don't look at it. Okay. <laughs> that is the thanks I get for trying to pack the hardest thing in the house, but okay. You know what, we're inside now and we're gonna pack the kitchen instead. Oh my God, that was, oh, I can't even think about it. Oh, I hate them. You know when you see like a bug or something and then you start to think that they're everywhere? Like I just grabbed Monkey's cat dish and I was like <laughs> looking inside of it first to make sure there were no giant dead cockroaches. Is this even fun to watch? This has been, <laughs> Chaotic. The monkey's here. Ooh, ooh. Okay, stop pushing away from me. He always does that when we're on camera together. I'm like, do you have another owner or something? Do you live somewhere else and you're not telling them? Okay, I need to pack. Why do I always hear things when I'm home alone? By the way, does everyone like my butterfly clip that I got? I'm probably never gonna wear it outside, but it felt like something from when I was a kid, so I bought it. Okay, we're gonna do another one. Today is the day we are moving. It is 8 a.m. I already got McDonald's. <laughs> Not for me. This is for the boys that are helping us today. They are 10 out of 10 and I can't eat McDonald's anymore because my stomach will kill me. We are going to start loading all the heavy stuff. Hopefully this doesn't take till one in the morning. I am foreseeing 
that it will but hopefully it does not. I will keep you updated on what is going on today, but it's mostly gonna be me running around like, like a chicken about to get its head cut off. Not cut off yet, but I'll let you know when it is. Okay, bye. We have been moving nonstop. I am so sweaty. Everything is basically in a box and downstairs. This is kind of what's left in my room. The hanger trash bag trick for clothes. I've been working on all that random stuff that just gets left behind at the end of a move that's like really annoying to do. Hopefully we will be done in a few hours. It's 7 30 so sun is like fully gone but yeah we'll see what happens. Wish us luck. I think the last clip that you probably saw was me packing something or no during the move the reason that there was absolutely no footage from this move is because simply because it was cursed it took so long it's actually two days later since we moved that night we were moving like every last thing until like two in the morning there was still stuff left at the other house that was not in a box and then the next day, we deep cleaned the entire house. Long story short, it took forever. So it was, it was a little bit cursed. I think I cried like two and a half times. The half time I stopped myself. Unfortunately, you didn't get to see every last second of the move, but did you want to? Did you want to be there along for the ride? I don't think so. So it doesn't really matter. But yeah, welcome to my new room. This is where we are going to do all the vlogs, all the things. I got a ton of stuff from Target and Home Goods, so let me show you what I got. Why is it not? Oh. My camera's being weird. Um, is this better? I feel like it's kind of the same. It's kind of, it's kind of worse. Whatever, we're staying here. So the first couple things I got from Target, I got these very fancy um, threshold bath towels. I got two of them. I got this bin, it's a very pretty bin. I wanted to get a bunch of these because they're just so fun and pretty, um, but I only got one. <laughs> so we'll see how I like it. It's for under my bathroom sink. I needed a new body wash and I really like these ones, the method ones that come in the different colors. I really wanted to try the like shea butter one, but they only had these and the blue one and the blue ones were full. So you know what that means, they suck. So I got this one. It's citrus, ginger, sea buckthorn, energy boot boost body wash smells good it smells like summer too and then i know that this brand this tree hut scrub is like super popular right now i see it all over tiktok i know your guys' secrets the little strawberry one that everybody's obsessed with i saw the strawberry one they had all of them and i smelled it finally and i was like it's just not that it's just it's just like a strawberry like scrub, which is exactly what it is, but it just, it's not worth the hype for me. So I have the Pina Colada body butter version of this. So I just got the matching scrub. So we're gonna be exfoliated and moisturized. And then I got these command hooks for just like things that I don't have to put nails in my wall for. And then the last thing were these memory foam very luxurious bath rugs. I did have this other bath rug from Target and it's so plush and squishy, but I laid it down, it was perfect. It was like this gray color and it wouldn't fit under the door, which is a problem. So I exchanged it for this, but these are really soft, so it should be fine. And then I went to Home Goods. I got, <laughs> I got this yoga block to crack my back. I got this um, like little, it's kind of ugly, but it's like this black marble like bathroom holder thingy. I'll put like Q-tips and you know, other things that go in bathrooms in there. And then for some reason, I couldn't find this stuff anywhere. I asked people at Target, like, do you guys have like the little mats that go in drawers and like cabinets and stuff? And they were like, and I was like, okay, like, that's fine. I guess no one has ever heard of this stuff, but I want to line all of my drawers and cabinets with this stuff in my bathroom because, you know, like people, I don't know, like people have lived here before, it's protective. So if you spill something, a drink, I don't know why you'd have a drink in your bathroom, but 
that's what this is for. It's protective and it's aesthetically pleasing because it's black, it matches all my stuff. And then I got this, I have been needing this for so long, but I got sheets. I have needed sheets for so long because I got my sheets, these ones, from Urban Outfitters because I wanted some black sheets and they are the scratchiest, like hottest sheets in the world. I hate them, they're horrible. I don't know why I just didn't return them when I got them. So I got this one, it matches my, okay, it doesn't perfectly match, but you get the idea. They're just gray sheets and it's like the pro chill cooling ones, so yeah. Oh, and then I found this liquid chlorophyll. I have never actually had my own one of these. I get like chlorophyll drinks from places, but I never have my own. So I got one of those. Hopefully it is not, ex it's not expired. Thank you, Jesus. And then the last thing I got, which there was only one of these and it was open. So hopefully everything is in there. But I got this shoe rack and this is the most perfect situation I could find. It's so ugly, it's not staying in my room. It's going in my closet, like against that wall in there. It holds the most amount of shoes. I think I counted and I have like 25 pairs of shoes. I have a, I have a lot, so yeah. This will hold all 1,000 of my shoes. And that's it, that's the haul. Let's build something, shall we? Okay, I didn't show you guys when I was building this, but I made this shoe rack. This shoe rack is demonically inspired. It was falling apart, these little poles were coming out. It was $10, so you get what you pay for. And now I'm gonna go out to dinner with my friends. My room is in shambles. I'm gonna try to build that when I get back. Little this thing and that's gonna be my dresser that goes in there for all of my other clothes might as well do an outfit of the day i am wearing this like jean jacket denim jumpsuit from 12th tribe it looks kind of hot outside so <laughs> hopefully it's not because i don't have anything under this and i can't take it off anyways i'm wearing this jumpsuit and i'm wearing my docks i need to tie that one up yeah we're not feeling 10 out of 10 today we're feeling like maybe four and a half out of 10. You know what? We're gonna get an Advil, maybe get a coffee. That sounds really good, actually. Okay, now I, I need to leave right now so I can get a coffee. I will maybe vlog when I'm there. We will see. If not, you will see me building that tonight. Okay, goodbye. Well, that's not good. All right, let's go. It's gonna take an hour to get there, so we'll have a lot to talk about. Oh, I'm not driving by myself. I'm picking up my friend Amanda. Okay, well, thank God I remember that. <laughs> Amanda, if you're watching this, I'm sorry. I was not gonna forget to pick you up. Hello. It is way later. This vlog is not consistent or consecutive, so don't expect it to be. I have my water, I have my Olipop, and I have this drill. I need to show you something very annoying and confusing, and I need advice about what to do. I am going to do one of the two tonight, so whatever you say won't really change my mind. Okay, so I'm putting up my drapes, and I... Okay, so I have this problem. It's a triangle, and I don't know whether to put the drapes all the way up there like the bar being at the very top of the tip or the drapes being right here and there being like a weird gap up there which would be kind of pointless because it's supposed to cover the whole window let me just ugh, i don't know what to do i already put one up over there the little holder thing i think i'm gonna do that because let me just show you okay so this is it if I don't cover the whole triangle. That makes like the most sense. If I put it all the way up here to cover the whole window, then look at this gap at the bottom. It's so awkward. And also this is like on the freaking ceiling. It's like too, yeah, no, I'm doing this. But yeah, so I'm gonna put it on like that line right there. And then I guess I'll just have sunlight streaming in in the morning that I didn't ask for, but it's a triangle window. It's a triangle window, so I can't, I sound like, I sound like the green donut boy. Okay, uh, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna put this up. Okay, time lapse time. 
Yay, we did it. Woo, we did one. Okay, how about I just show you this when we're done because this is probably not very exciting to watch. It's not exciting to do. By the way, if you have never had these Olipop drinks, these are so freaking good. This one is the strawberry, the strawberry vanilla. You'll get one, not sponsored. The cherry vanilla is even better. Okay, I'm gonna do this and I'll show you the finished product because <laughs> I know everybody wants to see my drapes. All right, finished product. This is the best I could come up with. Maybe I could have put it higher. No, because like the only thing about this window is that as high as I put it, like it's just gonna be more and more awkward down here. And I kind of want the drapes to come down like a little bit and not be like all the way up here. So this will have to do. I just want everything to be put away and up on the walls and for all this like clutter and mess to be gone because it's literally stressing me out. Like I hate any kind of mess in my room. And I have all my old Halloween costumes in there. I have to go to bed. So I might vlog a little bit more tonight, but probably not. So if not, good night. All right, good morning. I think this is actually the middle of a vlog. I don't know where I am anymore. I think the last thing I showed you was me putting up my drapes. That was a long time ago. <laughs> Anyways, we are back. Today I am going to, well, I'm going to an audition and then I'm going to Ikea because I have a dresser issue. I don't know if I showed you before, but I ordered a dresser from Amazon and I thought it was supposed to be like this big and it was like this big. Let me show you the situation. So this is the dresser. Again, I thought it was gonna be like this tall and it's teeny tiny, itty bitty. It's just not doing it for me. I have a bunch of pants on top of it. I have shorts next to it and it's not cute. So yeah, today I am gonna go to Ikea to see if I can find a new dresser and just switch all my stuff over because it would give me anxiety if all of my stuff were just like piled up in the closet. I'm probably gonna take it apart tomorrow send it back and then I'll have my new dresser. Hopefully, depending on what Ikea has at the moment, which they never have what I want, but we'll see. We're gonna go look at options. Okay, so I found the dresser I was looking for. This is it, it looks like the perfect size, but I'm looking for the darker color because I don't want this like white color. The only thing is that these drawers are not, the drawers are not very shallow, which I'm not in love with, but I think this is still the best option. This works. screaming because I got the last one. these boxes up the stairs. Oh my god. Part two. Take it apart. I need my big drill. Where's my, oh, my big drill. Take it apart. Oh, it's not plugged in. Okay, you know what? We're just gonna we're gonna start taking it apart. Oh, I just cracked my back. It felt so good. The more I'm taking this apart, the more angry I am knowing that I put this together, knowing it was too small, and kept going and put my stuff in it and used it for a week. And now I'm taking it apart, putting it in an Amazon box and shipping it back. Like what a freaking dummy. But I will say assembling things is so therapeutic to me. I feel like it is to a lot of people, maybe it's not, but it's so therapeutic to just like 
have easy steps and put something together and build something like not like being a carpenter or whatever i'm just talking about like doing this stuff like looking at pictures and putting stuff together like it's so fun i love using it is this an allen wrench what is this called this little one with the little like hexagon on it okay another time lapse ready go Okay, well these were not put in correctly. <laughs> Maybe I'm not very good at this. It's done. It's taken apart. Woo! All right, I have boxes one and two over here. So I'm guessing let's open box number one. Imagine if you had to open box number two. That would happen to me right now. Oh my god, it even sounds like it's gonna take a long time. Okay. Oh, okay. I gotta get under it. Oh my god. How heavy is this? 50 pounds. I lift a little more than that. Maybe it's because the weight is like, that's what it is. The weight is not distributed well for me, so it's like a little harder to carry than it normally is what's in here okay plank of wood okay hold up this is the side because this looks way bigger than I thought this is the side this has to be okay I'm just gonna guess it's a side move whatever full send oh my god there's so many Oh. Before I was like checking out at the at the checkout, the lady was like, "Do you have your receipt?" And I was like, "What? I'm paying right now. How would I have a receipt?" And she was like, "Oh, well, you were supposed to get one when you got the dresser from over there." And I was like, "Well, I didn't. So can I pay for it?" And she was like, "Um, yeah, but make sure you attach it to the wall." And I was like, "Okay." And she was like, "You have to attach it to the wall." And I was like, "Okay. Is it like..." gonna kill me <laughs> like I mean I feel like there's a reason why they warn you before you leave like they literally like grab you and they're like hey attach it to the wall um so maybe someone died I think it's going in my closet so it can't crush me from in there this is probably the top this looks bigger than I thought oh my god oh what is this big? oh this box smells so good Oh, it smells like the wood. Oh, we are gonna be up late tonight. Okay, step one is gonna take me three hours. <laughs> okay, I'm tired, I'm hungry. Okay, we got to the therapeutic part of the assembly. It was, it wasn't there, I was looking for it. Now we're here. Oh, also I started freaking out and was like getting super mad at Ikea because I couldn't find these. And it's like the very first step, couldn't find them, open the box. Sorry to Ikea for what I said. <laughs> I swear every time I turn the camera on, something goes wrong. I don't like that you can see me over there. That's weird. Jesus, help me, please. Okay, it works. See? That's all you need. Sometimes you just gotta pray about it and it will get better. You always have to pray about it and then it will get better. This is where we're at. We're at number eight. Now I see where the friend comes in handy. Okay, so I have the skeleton of the dresser complete. Um, hi, there's me on the other side. But yeah, that was really easy. So I'm just gonna do the rest. <laughs> okay, bye. I have like sawdust in my contact lenses. We're done. Let's take a look at it, shall we? Da, da, da. There it is. So much mess over here. Don't even, don't look at it. I am so happy with the size of it. This is what I was looking for. Something that comes like, cause this is for all of my like short, just like tops. The only thing I'm upset about, the drawers don't have wheels on them. They just, I don't know. The sides just like lock in, I guess, but they're not very smooth. They're kind of hard to pull out, but you know what? 
it's done. I am done. I'm gonna end the vlog here. I don't even know how long this vlog is at this point, but this dresser nightmare is over. Anyway, next vlog, I don't think I'm gonna do another moving series. I think this was it. This was tiring. Are you tired? I'm tired. <laughs> okay, I'm going to bed. Goodbye. Good night. See you in the next one. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe. Love you so much. Bye.